But you know, more than that, I hope that your standards are high because you know we both know that we do not rise to the level of our ambitions, but we rather fall to our lowest standards. Hey Jackie, happy birthday. So you just turned 25. I just turned 22, it's pretty cool, pretty exciting, and I just wanted to leave a quick message for you, man, because uh, you're the bro. But basically, I just wanted to say, you know, I hope you're doing well, um, for obviously selfish reasons. I hope that, you know, you're happy. I hope that your family is doing well. I hope that you are really living by the mantra that we've been, we've been about lately, you know? Uh, at, at least with the happiness part, right? With the idea that Happiness is more of appreciating what we have, being grateful for what we have, and less of getting what we want. Uh, I know that, you know, or you, we know that I'm working on it right now. You know, there's still a lot of stuff that I want uh, for whatever reason, but you know, I'm really working on that appreciation part and I hope that, you know, you got it figured out a little bit better than me. You know, you can hear me, but I can't really hear you. I can only imagine what you'd say. Uh, because let's be real, um, three years of a difference, a lot can happen. That's over, that's over a thousand days, right? We can be totally different people. So I hope that, you know, you're still cool. <laughs> yeah, so I want to keep this uh, message pretty short. I hope you're not cringing at me too bad. I hope that, uh, you know, you're passionate, you're driven, you are inspired. But, you know, more than that, I hope that your standards are high because, you know, we both know that we do not rise to the level of our ambitions, but we rather fall to our lowest standards. So with that, man, I hope your standards are high because, you know, you're going to have three years of time to work on it. Speaking of standards, I really wanted to emphasize the standards of, you know, our relationships. And it's, it's crazy because if I know you like I think I know you, then I know you're going to be a great friend to me in the sense that you're not going to judge me. You're not going to, well, maybe you might judge me, but you're, you're going to accept me for who I am. You're not going to try to change me because that's going to be pretty hard. But instead, you're just going to accept me and you're going to try to learn from me. And, you know, you're just going to take me for who I am and, you know, appreciate the good part of me that you get to have, right? But um, the reason I'm saying that is because I know that a relationship, even if it's with you and myself, it's pretty weird to think about, but even a, a relationship between us two is two ways, right? So when I am putting all this pressure on you, I realize I'm not being too great of a friend because, you know, um, you shouldn't have to have that pressure. You shouldn't have to have those uh, obligations to fulfill you know, what I want out of you. Um, so as a good friend, as me being a good friend to you, because I know I don't do that enough, that uh, I'm just gonna let you um, trust your intuition. I have faith that your intuition, that your uh, ability to figure stuff out is sufficient, you know, and that whatever you're doing, right? Because I could tell you all these lists and all these things that I hope you're doing, but instead I have faith that your intuition is going to carry you to a place that you're going to be happy with. So thanks for being a great friend. Thanks for, yeah, thanks for being a great friend, man. Thanks for uh, being a bro. And um, are you still saying bro in 20, uh, what is it? 2022? Because if you are, then I guess, I guess that's cool too. So I guess I'll uh, talk to you soon, man. Happy birthday.